All right, three years ago when I made my first sculpture, it took a lot of time and patience. But even though I put so much effort into it, it still didn't come out that great. Four years later, I spent four months, no, sorry, three years later, I spent four months on a similar sculpture, but this time, that effort was actually worth it. There are my sculptures. <laughs> sorry, by sign. Just like many people, it was very difficult to keep on going. And of course, patience is extremely, extremely important. Whether we're talking to someone, playing a game, writing a speech, or even listening to a speech as you are right now. Now there's a lot of gray area in other examples. Another example would be studying for a test. Is it worth studying all night, missing an event with a friend, getting no sleep to get that A plus or not? All right, so is it worth it or not? To begin answering this question, we must define patience. Patience, according to dictionary.com, is the capacity to calmly endure pain in trying situations. To make things more clear, capacity is, in fact, the maximum that someone or something can obtain. Along the way of making either of these sculptures, I just had to try again and again. And it was very quite difficult. By definition, we can see that patience by itself doesn't mean a lot of patience. Instead, it means how much we can tolerate, how much we can take while still tolerating it. Now, sometimes it'll be worth it and sometimes it will not. By seeing how it's worth it or not, we can begin seeing this idea of patience as a kind of currency. The patience I put into my sculptures is how much I invest into it. But like any other investment, it may or may not be worth it. Sorry. Um, you're in everyone else's patience. It's what gets you places. It's what gets you what you want. How much you put into it, how much you, how much you want to get your goal, or what you get out of your goal, is what determines how much it's worth. Now, waiting in line at In-N-Out takes a lot of patience, as we may all know. If you really want that burger, then it'll be worth it. But if you don't really want that burger, you'll probably end up leaving. Now, sometimes you will think that something won't be worth it, but it ends up being pretty worth it. Let's say you were waiting in line and predicted that the burger wasn't gonna taste that good, but you decide to stay anyways. Then by the time you get that burger, you realize that, wow, I'm glad I stayed in line. This burger is pretty good. The same thing happened to me with my other sculptures. With my first sculpture. I thought that it visually didn't look that worth it, but it ended up being quite worth it because I put all that effort into it, and without that effort, my later sculpture may have not ever existed. The same thing could happen, but backwards. You may think that something will be worth it, but when you see the outcome, it ends up not being what you thought you wanted. So, your goals, your small goals, or even your big goals, will take some sort of discomfort. This suffering may or may not be worth it to you, but we will all need our patience and our goals at some point in our life. As St. Teresa of Avila puts it, let nothing disturb you, let nothing distress you. All things pass, patience attains all it strives for. Thank you for being patient.